Hello. This video tutorial will explain how to go through Open Enrollment through Employee Navigator. When your company sets up its Open Enrollment, you will receive a notification email and should log on to Employee Navigator to select your benefits. If you do not already have an account, you will need to find your original Welcome to Employee Navigator email and use the registration link to create an account before participating in Open Enrollment. If you need assistance, contact your HR manager. If you have an account already, log in. Once you see the home page, the blue Welcome banner will notify you there is an active open enrollment and how long it will last. To begin, press Start Benefits. You will be asked to review your personal information. An open enrollment is a time in which you can make changes. Once you've verified your information, you can press Save and Continue. Next, you can review, edit, or add dependents, and press Save and Continue when you are done. Now you can make your benefit selections. Employee Navigator will provide you with the benefits that are up for renewal or change. First, choose who you want to enroll in your benefit. It could be just you or yourself and any dependents. Note that the system will automatically adjust costs when you add or take off a dependent. The right-hand side of the screen will show you which benefit plan you are currently enrolled in. To get more information about possible plans, you can click the Details button on the right side of the plan box to see plan details and copay costs. If you would like to compare the plans side by side, click the Compare button on the left-hand side of the plan box and you can see the costs associated with each option for each plan. On the right-hand side of the page, there will also be links to helpful documents or even videos with information about the plans. Once you have enough information and have made a choice, you can now select the plan you want by clicking Select, and a check mark will show in the upper left-hand corner of the selected plan box. Alternatively, you can choose to deny the benefit by clicking Don't Want This Benefit in the lower right-hand corner of the screen, and you will then be asked to provide a reason why. After either selecting your new plan or denying the benefit, you can press Save and Continue. Once you have gone through all the plans up for open enrollment, you can review all your changes, and you will be asked to click Agree in the green box. We will now go back to the home page. You can go back in and make changes to your new plans at any time until the open enrollment period closes by clicking Update Benefits in the blue Welcome banner, which will also show a countdown of how long you have until open enrollment closes. During or after the open enrollment period, you can review all your benefit enrollments by clicking Benefits on the home screen and clicking Enrollment Summary on the right side. Here you can see your enrollment and their respective costs per pay period. If you have any questions, your company's HR contact can always be found in the top right-hand corner of the page. We hope this video has been a helpful walkthrough of how to complete open enrollment through Employee Navigator.